With Windows Vista upon us, you will definitely need a RAM upgrade at some point. RAM is your temporary memory that gives your computer a little more breathing room and allows it to work faster. Or if you're trying to extend the life of an older computer, you will also want to upgrade RAM at some point. First place you're going to want to head is to the internet, crucial.com, Internet, Internet Explorer. You can also go to a couple of other sites like kingston.com and a few others, but I just prefer Crucial's tool. I also like their service. You're going to scroll down and look for Scan My System. You're going to click on that little button there, click their little box agreeing to their terms, and then click Start My System Scan. If you're using Windows XP, you're going to get a little yellow stripe at the top that says, do you want to install this ActiveX control? Click it and say yes. Apparently here in Windows Vista, because Vista is so great and nothing works in it, we have to click here to download the manual beta scanner. So we'll go ahead and do that. What the heck, this is live video. And instead of save it, we're going to run it directly from the web. So now the scan is running. When the scan finishes, you'll see a report telling you what's currently in your system. This is my current configuration and what you can add to your system. So I have two slots that are being used, two memory slots that are not being used. And if I scroll across, it tells me what I can do and how much it would cost for me to upgrade my RAM. On this side, it tells you what type of RAM that you're using. So I'm using DDR PC24100, all these little acronyms and numbers. What this will do for you is you can print this out and if you don't want to buy online, you can take it to your local computer shop or electronic store and ask them for this type of memory. These are the RAM chips right here, the memory chips. You'll notice they have these little white clips here on the side. All you need to do to take the old ones out is flip the little switch and there's going to be two on each end, or one on each end of the chip. So after you've opened the little doors, just pull the little chip out. And then what you'll notice is that all RAM chips have a little notch in the middle. And the notch corresponds, sometimes there's more than one notch, this one has two notches. And the notches correspond to a spot in the memory slot in the computer. So we're going to pull both of those out. The new ones are here. So we can see the notches in the spots where we're going to put the new memory chips. I'm just going to line the memory chip up on those little slots. And once it's lined up, you just need to use your thumb and put a little bit of pressure on both sides of the memory chip and you'll hear it click into place. And we'll do the second one the same way. And that's all there is to a memory upgrade.